Hello, I'm Rob from The Malt Miller and today we're going to talk about a 5 litre mini keg and how to set it up uh, for dispense. So there's various different parts uh, to this system. Here we have the actual keg itself. Now as standard this keg comes with a screw top, single skin uh, stainless steel keg that can be used basically as a, as a storage device. We have our a new multi-use universal regulator. Now in this guise, it's set up to use these 16 gram bulbs. However, this uh, regulator can also, um, with the use of some different adapters, can be used with a soda stream cylinder or a big pub, like a six kilo um, pub CO2 bottle. Now we'll cover that in a completely different video. This connects to a gray, um, gas in disconnect. Here we have the actual keg lid itself so this allows you to use the disconnects on the on the keg and here we have our tap set up. Now this is a stainless steel flow control into tap. You can use any tap as it happens but um, for, for this demonstration we're going to use the, the flow control into tap. If you're going to be serving anything more than say a cast condition sort of style I would suggest you do use the flow control it's a really handy device. Now connected onto this flow control tap we have the tap shank adapter this is sold as a separate part as is this tap handle. Now uh, just show you how this goes together so we have the, uh, the lid itself and we have a silicon dip tube which we simply push on This goes right to the bottom of the dip tube, goes right to the bottom of the keg. That screws on it, it's got a nice silicon, nice silicon seal. Now the uh, disconnect on this side with the slots in it, whenever you see slots in a disconnect, that means it's gas. So simply push on push on the gas side if I spin that round perhaps you can see that now this can go in any plane by adjusting it we can put that in any any plane we like so wherever it's handy to have that it can go next up is to assemble the tap here we've got the uh, disconnect simply screws into the tap shank adapter and then simply pushes on like any other disconnect. Hear the snap and there you go. That's now set up ready for dispense. So you've got your regulator here um, where you can actually adjust and see the dial go up, fill the keg with CO2. You've also got a pressure relief valve here. Now this pressure relief valve, PRV, is set for 20 PSI. Um, now it's obviously slightly lower than a corny keg or corny, corny this style keg. However, it's plenty good enough to um, force carbonating, um, lagers, really what, whatever whatever you need. Nothing really needs to be more than more than 20 PSI. So that that PRV will blow at 20 PSI. Mm -hmm.